How's it going everyone? Welcome back to Graham Games and welcome to the final installment of the Halloween drunken horror game extravaganza. I feel like I've suddenly consistently called it the same thing more than once, maybe not consecutively, but at least more than once. So, start of every episode. Shut. There we go. So now we're ready to get down to business. Fuck this game right off the bat. Flickering lights in the menu screen. <laughs> I'm drinking fireball. It's so syrupy. It just like sticks to your lips. <laughs> but seriously, you're gonna have flickery lights in your fucking menu screen. You're gonna start being scary and terrifying with staring ter terrifying <laughs> sounds. Right off the bat, in the menu, you're gonna have scary sounds and fucking terrifying shit like flickering lights in your goddamn menu. Why am I even playing this game? <sighs> I obviously can't handle it, but I have to. It is part of the mission that I set myself out. It's two in the morning. I've been playing these fucking horror games for like three hours at this point. From what you told, you think there are someone staring this trouble up, right? Yes, yeah, just like I told you. I don't know if she used words. Is she that fast of a talker? Use any method in all means to crush our limbs. That is not. Great looking art, the car looks good, she did not. I agree, but don't you think spreading rumors about haunted ghosts is a bit irrational? There's something fucked about the voice acting there. Either that or she's just from like New Zealand or some shit. However, it does cause a delay of the construction of my laser. The labels run away and it affects a lot of my plan. I understood. That's the reason a lot of the- wow, those are some fucked up tits. <laughs> <laughs> and her face as well, but like her body is thin, and then she's got like disproportionately thick arms going on, and huge hands. Holy fuck, her hands are big. I feel like I'm missing out on the story here. I think all of the other ones I've played are like established, like well-known scary horror games. This one is just like a random thing that I picked up that I don't think I realized right away was like much newer and not as like widely renowned. So let's just see. We're just playing the, the little, the little Daka. It's it's close enough to Lil Dick Inside that that just sounds funny. That doesn't sound that scary, does it? All right, there's something about the lighting in this game in particular that much more so than the ones I've played before. I'm gonna try some different lighting and I'm gonna see how fucked it looks. Ooh, lamp light. I mean, it kind of blinds me a little bit, but I'm just trying to be spooky for you guys. <laughs> it only blinds me a little bit. Give my eyes time to adjust. Let those corneas burn a little bit and those the retinas fuse together and then I'll be able to see just fine. I don't know, was it stupid to have all the lights on in the other episodes? I don't know, I just wanted you guys to see me. I wanted you to see what was going on. It seemed like the right thing to do. I realize people typically play this shit in the dark, I just don't have a great setup for that. Maybe I have a, maybe I do. Maybe I was wrong. Good, I can jump. So let's go jump in the, jump in the fountain, recreate the beginning of Friends and ignore the fact that there's blood smeared literally everywhere. Like it, oh, it's leaves. Oh, it's leaves. Why are we so scared about leaves, guys? Shift! Always! Always means run. Wow. Like, graphically? Somehow, this thing, this random game that I picked up, might be the best so far. Investigate the museum. Oh. I don't know what it is, but I don't like the fact that this fucking thing starts in a hallway you know what I mean that you don't walk forward at all the, immediately in the entrance it's just hallways on either side who the fuck builds a building that way that's some horrible fucking horrible shit uh, honestly I, I needed like a, a little break from the horror games and so I went and watched some like funny videos and shit like uh, I was watching a little bit of iDubs, and then I went down some rabbit hole of some Filthy Frank videos, and I've never seen Filthy Frank. Well, like, I've seen viral shit of his, or, like, clips or memes or whatever, but never any, like, one of his actual videos. 
I think in my drunken state, it was funnier than I ever found it before. And so I was watching some of that, and I was like, wow, this is great. And now all of a sudden I'm coming back, and I remember why I took that break. Because look at that. Because fuck this. Oh, don't turn off all the goddamn lights. Why would it turn off all the lights like that? <laughs> why would there just be pictures of babies on the walls? Why would the pictures... Why would the lights be flickering so much? I already... I called you out on this horse shit in the fucking main menu. I don't want any fucking flickering lights, and here you are flickering every goddamn light. Is it better or worse that this doll is fucking life-sized? I think it might be a little bit worse. Because this doll could actually fuck you up. Chucky's not that scary. Because if Chucky came at me with a goddamn knife, I'd kick him in his fucking head. Like, I, I never really I never really got it. I've seen, like, one of the Child's Play movies. And it was one of the really old ones, so it's a little dated and everything. He just punched that little fucker in the head. Or kick him. It's gonna be. You can't really punch down. You can't really punch down that well. I think you gotta kick. I think kicking is your only option. That light is too bright, and there's too many stains on this floor. But I don't want to go backwards. Going backwards seems like it's never the right decision. I hate. I hate when I can't find the way to operate the elevator. Call the maintenance guy. Go home. Go home. Or, like, why Why is this Why is this museum even open? There is blood soaking every goddamn inch of this place. It's smeared all over the walls. The doll is clearly haunted. The staircase is broken. The hallway is fucked. Everything about this place is fucked. Why are we here? Why are we trying to make it a thing? Oh, no, 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 no. Why didn't we give up on this place fucking forever ago? Why are we here right now? Who cares about making the elevator work? Do you know what the better option is? Run the fuck out. Just go outside. Just just hoof it in any goddamn direction. Try your hand. And <laughs> hitchhiker. Anyone will do. It doesn't matter what kind of threats or weapons they appear to have on them. It doesn't matter. Anything's better than this. Guys. I might have some kind of like scare limit that I might have hit today because <sighs> all of a sudden I'm just at this stone wall. I just either this is scarier than the shit I've been dealing with already or uh, I've just fucking I've just hit the limit already. Eat interact. Eat interact. Close the goddamn door. Uh, either that or just slip some mail through the slot. <laughs> please don't kill me. <laughs> just, just, please. Oh. <laughs> uh, Fuck off forever. Oh god. Alright, if I go to this, are the is the main doll gone? She's still there. Alright, alright. Now we just gotta deal with these little dolls. These are some nice kickable head crushable dolls. Can I close that behind me? Oh well the fact that I can and the fact that it did so fast and aggressively doesn't doesn't put my mind at ease. I don't it, is, it doesn't make me feel better about the situation. Come on. Who who got murdered in such a way? That's some shiny ass blood. Maybe it's not blood. It's probably not blood. I mean if blood is that old and it's shining that much, couldn't be. Couldn't possibly be. It's just oil. Don't worry about it, guys. Nothing to be afraid of. Oh good. Another life sized fucking doll. I don't know about you guys, but I don't like this lighting. I like I I dislike this lighting. I'm suddenly less safe because there's less lighting in the room. I didn't think it would make that big of a fucking difference, but I think it kind of does. Because now, now everything in my room that I'm dealing with is asymmetrical. Now all of a sudden instead of this nice uniform, protective light, I got this one goddamn angel on my shoulder, devil, devil on the right, all that shit. I hate you. I, I hate your shit. I hate the way that it looks like you've been broken and put back together. I hate the way that I can't see your face. I hate everything about you. I hate all these dolls. I hate their fucking shit. Oh, that was too fast and in the wrong direction. This the... Did I just get jump scared by opening a fucking door? I think I did. Them's the rules. What the fuck? M. M for map. <laughs> There's no map in this game. Zero health in the in the bottom left there plus zero. I hate this. I 
the second I die, I think I'm quitting this fucking game. Because it's the final one. It's exactly what I promised it would be. Oh, fucking... Oh, this room's well lit. But, like, honestly, what the fuck is... Oh, save game. What do you know? <laughs> Suck my dick, game. I learned how to save. Uh, there's no dolls hiding in that chair, which I thought was absolutely going to happen. I did it! Problem solved. Game over. I activated the elevator. There's nothing to fear anymore. Oh, don't put me in a cutscene where I can't do anything. What the fuck? What is with this bendy flashlight? Who builds a fucking flashlight that shape? That's not a practical shape for a fucking flashlight. <sighs> I hate this. I'm fucking petrified. After all this time we've spent together, how? Oh, what the fuck? How do? How? Do, oh god! Now there's no light other than my fucking flashlight. Are you kidding me? Okay, well I can see your face now, but am I am I in a different room? Have you guys changed at all? No, I can just light you up better. All the other lights are out. How the fuck? When the fuck did that happen? <sighs> no jump scare. Didn't lose. I just can't handle this shit right now. Come the fuck on. There was three of them before. I'm like, I'm I'm so wary of things changing. Yeah. Aw, oh, yeah, this game can't scare me. <laughs> look how look how in tune I am. Look how much attention I'm paying. The game can't you can't pull a fast one on me. I know everything there is to know. Fucking interact. I, I said interact. I'm gonna go ahead and assume that wasn't there before. It just wasn't. It wasn't! I don't need to make those kinds of assumptions. I know that it wasn't. Don't take the elevator, man. Go back out through the door. All right, well, you're still there. Are you not the one who wants to play? No, oh, fuck off. The, the initial jump scare is the whole thing. Oh, fuck, run, shift, sprint, fucking, oh, God. Oh, fuck, I wasn't ready for that. Oh, fuck off, no, God, oh, th Thank fuck, she's just a dumb doll and was only just born. She's not gonna know how elevators work. <laughs> well, that was it. That was at least a gem scare, if not two. Beer drinking time. Give me, give me a fucking second. I need, I need to fucking pause. Next beer at the ready for the inevitable next jump scare. I'm a little bit surprised more people haven't played this game because this might be one of the more well put together of what I've played tonight. That is some sparkly ass blood. What the fuck? Okay. Oh, my, uh, my flashlight was turned off. I was wondering what the hell was going on. Left click fire? The shit. Oh, now I have a gun? Holy shit, I have a gun! Oh my god, I don't have to be scared of anything. Are you kidding me? This is incredible. And several magazines worth of ammo? Wow. <laughs> I feel invincible. I've never I've never had save. Yes, yeah, save. I've 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 never had a weapon in a horror game before. I feel okay. I feel like things might be all right. I'm Canadian. We don't own guns unless we're hunters. Fuck off! Oh god, it's still scary. No, 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 it's still scary. I take it back. Did you reload? Fucking shoot it. Kill it. God damn it. It was still scary. I take it back. But like, man, where I come from, everyone owns guns because I come from a fucking small town. But like, the only reason everyone owns a gun is because they're a hunter. Like, one in 50 people own, like, safety, I'm scared for my family type guns. By the way, I, I, I that counts. That was scary. Safety guns aren't a thing, and maybe, maybe I suddenly get it. That little baby doll scared the shit out of me, and it was, it was like a foot tall. Maybe, maybe I take back what I said about Chucky. Oh, fuck! Maybe, maybe Chucky is scary. I fucking... Oh, the whole point of this drinking extravaganza was that 
spear was supposed to take the edge off. This game's scary as fuck. Fuck me. God damn it. And also... There, there's like, at least there's a lot of ammo. Where the fuck, what was that? Oh, fuck! God, fucking damn it. Oh my god. I mean, I'm expecting it. It did like a, a, a warm up, a warm up scream. I knew it was coming. Fuck. I knew it was coming. Oh shit, I just spilled my beer. Oh fuck. Huh, that was the scariest thing that happened so far. Crisis averted. <laughs> I thought having a gun would give me this nice sense of security and I wouldn't have to be worried but this game it, it has like a very tense setting and then shit jumps at you and then it doesn't just jump at you but it's an actual threat at that point because when it jumps at you it's not an immediate loss you then have to defend yourself like there is that tiny window where you could kill it before it kills you and that is a very intense moment Shit, when you reload, it, it, it does real gun logic, not fake gun logic where, you know, if you had two ammo and you reload, all of a sudden you have 12 ammo or whatever. No, it goes down to 10. I wasted two bullets by reloading. So that's, that's like, I don't really know how guns work, but that, I think, seems to be m more similar to real logic than otherwise. <sighs> okay, that, that two minutes of cleanup was not enough that it did not take me long to get back into me being fucking terrified is this the power room it won't open that's the power room nah I don't know if I want to <laughs> fucking stairs that go nowhere no 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 fuck that no no are those are those the stairs from a the, the stairs from downstairs that I couldn't access. Fuck! God, fuck! Oh, is it spitting at me? <laughs> that might have been my loudest, most aggressive fuck yet. Oh, what is happening? What is screaming at me? You piece of shit, you motherfucker! <laughs> at least I can defend myself. I, I'm back on board with defending myself is a good thing. Because at least. There is that moment of satisfaction where you kill that little fucking demon that ran at you. That's a couple drinks though, because both those motherfuckers scared me. I think that's still the theater. That is a lot of blood. Fuck you. Can't kill it. Can't shoot it. Can't shoot it if it doesn't leave its fucking bulletproof glass case. Apparently... <laughs> Nope, nope, no, 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 where are you coming from? Ah, uh, yeah, I saw you coming. Ah, oh, you little fucker. I heard you coming. Oh, shit. <laughs> ah, you're not that scary when you're coming at me nice and slow like that. I got time to pop some caps. As, as I usually say in my cool guy lingo. I don't know what this room is. Don't think I've been here before. I assume as soon as I I assume as soon as I go for this that something's going to come for me. Process the power room. That looks like a human. Oh, hoo hoo. That got me a little bit. That was a mild scare. You can you can I can get at least a tiny sip for that. That was, that was a tinier sip that I meant to take, but that's what I was going for, was a tiny sip. This game is kind of, uh, it's, I'm, I'm getting used to it to an extent. I, I'm, the, the jump scares and where things are coming from is becoming more predictable. I just gotta take things slower and know that things are waiting for me at basically every corner. Fuck you. Fuck you a bunch. <laughs> now, do I go to the theater? Can't interact with that door. Not an option. Also not an option. What the fuck does the key that I have interact with? 
See, now suddenly I'm scared again. Because now I, now I don't know what to do or where to go. And I don't like that feeling. Oh, fuck. Oh, God. Why did it work? Why did... I did it again. I got jump scared by a fucking opening door. God damn it. I just have to be standing in the right place. Interact. Activate the elevator. Hopefully there's ammunition in this room. It's just a bunch of goddamn computers. A bunch of goddamn ancient times computers. Fuck. Now I just know that I woke up. More fucking dolls. Fuck this doll museum. What a dumb place to spend some time. Where are you? Where are you running at me from? Where the fuck are you coming from? That also sounded like gunfire, though. That's... That's... Worrisome, because either these dolls learned... That's new. That wasn't there before. Does that mean one of these dolls fucking killed a guy just now? These dolls know how to use guns Mr. now? Are you alright? Why are you here? What the fuck's Mr. Wilhelm? Is that who was talking to me at the beginning of this game? It has been a long time since the beginning of this game, by the way. Like, half an hour. That wasn't me. I'm not gonna make it. That's fucking spooky. But I've got all the evidence. It's in the office room. On the first floor. I think it's just evidence, by the way. I don't know if evidence is, is actually the plural of evidence. Just so you know. Just so you take that with you to the grave. I have to know what's happening here. I really hope I'm not wrong about that, because then I'm a real dick for in one guy's dying moments trying to correct him about something that I was wrong about. Come the fuck on. It's two in the fucking morning. Two twenty. It's two twenty in the morning if you want an actual time. I thought I'd be done with this shit. I thought each of these games was gonna take 15, 20 minutes, somewhere in that range. This is just too stressful. I see you over there, and I got, just so you know, got a crosshair right on your fucking head. So don't wake up and decide you're gonna come fucking kill me, cause I'm I'm ready for you. I'm at least a little ready for you. All right. Oh fucking please, please. It's, it's it's still so funny to me. This game has saves, but. Now that I see that this game is longer than I expected, it, it, it's starting to make more sense. Oh, please. Oh, fucking... Come on. I hate how close you have to stand and pick them up. Because I, I, I'm i just trying to pick them up and get it uh, fucking over with. I don't have time to inch closer and closer. It won't open. Of course it won't open. What about this guy? I, don't, I just don't have time. Oh, fuck! What the fuck? Oh, God. You're a fast one, aren't you? I, I realized as I was as I was saying it, and it, it was almost jokey, like, "Oh, you're a fast one, aren't you?" But in that moment of when I was saying it, understand that every muscle in my body was still at like full tightness. Like, no, 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 no fuck this. Oh, that's a drink. That's not a real door. It's not a real door that goes anywhere. I was f completely flim flim fammed. Flim flammed, foozled, fooled. Where the fuck? Where are you coming from? Where, 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 where? Oh, fuck, that counts. That's a jump scare. Fuck you both. I'm gonna shoot you in the head. I'm gonna shoot you both in the goddamn head. Oh, fuck, I'm stuck in a goddamn corner. Use medkit, use medkit, use medkit. What the fuck? I just, I just don't think I have it in me anymore. I just don't. I just. Oh. I just don't have it in me. I can't I can't do it right now. I can't play this goddamn game to the end. I think I might hate Halloween. I hate horror games, that's for sure. That's one thing I know. Thank you guys so much for watching. It's been so much fun. So fun. Really though, it's been the worst. I have gone from playing two horror games in my life, Amnesia, which I never beat. I played for about three hours altogether. It was very close to the end. Never actually beat it. Play With Me, which I played right here on the channel for seven minutes before I fucking fear quit that game. And now all of a sudden I sit down and play, what was it, three, four hours of fucking horror games for you guys? 
Ah, so maybe next year, maybe in a year's time, I'll come and play more scary games. Maybe, maybe once in a blue moon outside of that, I'll play a scary game if like a shitload of you guys recommend it. But realistically, fuck this. Fuck all of this. No thank you. <laughs> I hope you guys have a happy Halloween. I hope that this gave you a few scares and a few laughs. That'd be ideal, right? Scary for Halloween. Funny because no one actually likes being scared. So you need that nice little, if you're going to be scared, you need something to, to raise it back up. Even it back out, you know? <laughs> So if you can be scared and then watch someone else be scared, perfect. Level playing ground. So thanks for watching. I'll see you again next time. And presumably next time will be whatever the happiest game I can find. <laughs>